Hello everyone, it's Jessica Wilkinson, your Young Adult Services Librarian, and for this week's Teen Book Talk, it's all about missing. The first book is The Lost Girls by Heather Young. In the summer of 1935, six-year-old Emily Evans vanishes from her family's vacation home on a remote Minnesota lake. Her disappearance destroys her mother, who spends the rest of her life at the lake house hoping in vain that her favorite daughter will walk out of the woods. Emily's two older sisters stay too, each keeping her own private decades-long vigil for the lost child. Sixty years later, Lucy, the quiet and watchful middle sister, lives in the lake house alone. Before she dies, she writes the story of that devastating summer in a notebook that she leaves, along with the house, to the only person to whom it might matter, her grandniece Justine. For Justine, the lake house offers a chance to escape her manipulative boyfriend and give her daughters the stable home she never had. But it's not the sanctuary she hoped for. The long Minnesota winter has begun. The house is cold and dilapidated. The frozen lake is silent and forbidding. And her only neighbor is a strange old man who seems to know more than he's telling about the summer of 1935. Soon, Justine's troubled oldest daughter becomes obsessed with Emily's disappearance. Her mother arrives with designs on her inheritance and the man she left behind launches a dangerous plan to get her back. In a house steeped in the sorrows of the woman who came before her, Justine must overcome their tragic legacy if she hopes to save herself and her children. The next book is Sadie by Courtney Summers. Sadie hasn't had an easy life growing up on her own, She's been raising her sister, Maddie, in an isolated small town, trying her best to provide a normal life and keep their heads above water. But when Maddie is found dead, Sadie's entire world crumbles. After a somewhat botched police investigation, Sadie is determined to bring her sister's killer to justice and hits the road following a few meager clues to find him. When Mess Wes McCray a radio personality working on a segment about small forgotten towns in America, overhears Sadie's story at a local gas station. He becomes obsessed with finding the missing girl. He starts his own podcast as he tracks Sadie's journey, trying to figure out what happened, hoping to find her before it's too late. And the last book is Vanishing Girls by Lauren Oliver. Dara and Nick used to be inseparable, but that was before the accident that left Dara's beautiful face scarred and the two sisters totally estranged. When Dara vanishes on her birthday, Nick thinks Dara is just playing around. But another girl, nine-year-old Madeline Snow, has vanished too, and Nick becomes increasingly convinced that the two disappearances are linked. Now, Nick has to find her sister before it's too late. These are just three of the great books about missing people that can be found in the teen area, so be sure to come on in and check them out. Thank you.